<laughs> that is just too funny. I just offered on a whim uh, the Mughal Confederacy to, to give me a peace treaty, and they're like, well, they unconditionally accepted a peace treaty. Um, wow. Just wow. That's gonna end up in like the world's greatest backstab. Yeah, that was incredibly surprising. Like, literally right after that video, I just auto-resolved whatever was already on the field. And then I tried to offer them, you know, a peace agreement. And they are like, yeah, just don't, just, just stop hitting us. Just stop hitting us. They gladly accepted it. Shameful. Like, I, like, I know that it's an, an AI... But even the the AI has to know that I'm just gonna backstab it again. I mean, once I get a couple turns worth of trade and get everything all suppressed, I'm just gonna go after him a second time. Complete and utter foolishness. Ah, <sighs> foolishness, foolishness, foolishness. I can't decide how I'm gonna get into Europe, if I'm just gonna pack up and land there, or what I'm gonna do, but I'm guessing I'm probably just gonna walk in there through Persia and just do it that way. Seems to be like that'd be, you know, the the best way. But, even so, hmm. India! I know that I'm gonna need at least one ship to carry a, a unit stack down to, uh, What's that? Calcutta? Or... That territory that was a, uh... It belonged to Amsterdam. I need to send a few units down to secure this, this because this is very, very wealthy. And once I take it over, pretty much nothing will try to, try, try to, you know, take it away. Okay. Let's rebuild our Thurker's Court. That gives us plus one repression in the in the region, and then it'll maybe let us take a, a, a little bit of th or a couple taxes better. All right. Um, cannot decide if I want to burn down the uh, burn down that that college. I'm probably not gonna do it just so I can have you know three colleges in uh, in India where they're pretty much you know untouchable. Okay. Wait, there's penalties for learning that tech that uh, technology. What is it? Oh, negative one half, negative one. Hmm. Tenanted farms. Let's let's just build wineries. Explosive shells under research. Military syllabus under research. Drill school. What do you give us? Barger lancers. Not bad gives us the same infantry lancers basically that just lets us rec recruit and gives us another um, unit slot but let's end out another turn just to, gotta get that damn repression down and I feel like if I just you know end a couple turns not recording something major is gonna happen and you guys know exactly what I'm talking about Sweden. Okay, the Mughals are doing their their thing. We're gonna pull in a massive amount of trade income this turn, especially because the Mughals aren't you know sapping our centuries now. <laughs> gonna have to spend. All right, the Mughals want trade. They want plug bayonet. Uh, sure, why not? I think the game just auto repaired some of the structures for us. Hard to say, hard to say. I know that I'm gonna have to rebuild our, or repair the trade, uh, what the, I'm gonna crush them. Rebellion in Hindustan, I half expected that. Um, trade port, cheap to fix. Trade port, again, this one's gonna be pretty cheap to, to fix. Let's 
check our finances again. We'll see exactly what we're pulling in as far as trade goes. Um, trade is not as good as I thought it was. What is this? What is blocking this? Let's follow it back to the source. Um, we're at peace with them. What is this? No, we're at peace with we're at peace with those guys. They should not be doing that. Um, real question is, who are we at, at at war with? Pirates? Are the pirates doing it? Because like, I mean, like, I could totally see them doing it. Because it's not them. It's not them. Let's see. It's got to go through here. Let's find it. Yeah, it's still pushing a crap load of money through there. Um, check the Ivory Coast. It's not in the Ivory Coast. Okay. So between France and me, some someone's blocking it. You know what? That do really does not even make any sense. What the? It's is it more? It might be Morocco, but I would hope not because they're they can stay there forever and do doing basically nothing. Okay. Are these guys repressed enough for us to be able to take our stuff out? I'm not thinking. I'm not thinking of it. Build up the T. School of Arts. And we cannot build a Thurker's Mansion yet in that, in that location. Two religious unrest. Four religious unrest. We're gonna have to have a lot of cleanup crew kind of thing going through here as far as the uh, religion goes. Let's just clean these guys out. Let's just clean them out. Yeah, I'll fight them on the battle map. It'll help me lose less. Where did my Mountain Dew go? There it is. 1.5 liter. Quick drink of that. Okay. Do do. Where is this? Is a good hill. Yeah, that's a commanding view of of the uh, local area. Three, three, three. Okay. Do this. We'll do this. Because if I know the enemy, they're going to try to run up, up this hill and they're going to try to get me. So, not the smartest idea. No, 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 no. Those units are just going to stick out the edge there just for purely for show. Whoa! Get the general out of there. Yikes! Run, 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 run! Oh, they slaughtered two, two of our elephants too. Yeesh! That's one of the the major downsides of having elephant elephant general bodyguards is uh, when the when the enemy tries to snipe your general using um, cannons, they hit way way more often. It's just the way it is. It's totally understandable too, because elephants are giant targets. If they kill my general, I'll be very, very cross. 
All right. Just like I said, they're running up to us. Let's let them run up to us. <laughs> Bring them within range of, of of our guns. They're in range. These 18 pound guns are freakishly good. Keep on shelling them. <sighs> well, that was weird. That like froze up for like a, a second. That's super weird. Come on, land a single shot. Like, it froze up, but obviously everything was, like, still going. Wahumia Bowman? Well, these are my Maratha cannons. Alright, you know what? Boring. Clear misses. Move them all up. Move them all up. The old switcheroo is what we're going to give these guys. Nice. <laughs> Fire. Trafungis. I don't even know what a Trafungi is. Or a Tufangi? Tufangi? I had no idea. Some kind of militia, I guess. Saw that one coming. <laughs> well, that went remarkably well. Alright. Uh, let's just pure and utterly over overwhelm these guys. Thing we need to, to get a hold of those enemy cannons too. What size cannons are these anyway? 12 pounders? 12 pound, no problem. We have 18 pound cannon. Doing some mega damage. I don't really think anyone really knows what kind of cannons that the uh, Moogles have late games. I really don't don't think anyone does. That was a miss that like I've I can nice. <laughs> he bounced the cannonball through the ranks. I was just about to uh, call him out and say, you know, I could shoot that flipping cannon better. That's a miss. I was just about to flip out him on, on him and just be like, I could shoot that cannon better. What the heck's wrong with it, with, with this guy? Camel Nomads are routing, or, well, they're not routing per se, they're just running away. There we 
There we go. Moving it on up. Per se. Move up. There we go. Fire. Yeah, I just need to get them to like not shoot through, you know, eat each other basically. And we'll then we can call it even. And that grape shot needs to stop. Those canisters need to stop happening. Oh, they just got flanked. Oh yeah, that that was awesome. Alright. Heroic victory. No surprise there. Okay. Wait, now we have a really big bo big bonus here. Um, let's re- Oh, we can't rebuild that. Darn. Darn, 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 darn. Can we- Yeah, we can do it here. Alright, let's end that. Those rebels are probably gonna try to break, break some, some of our stuff now that I see them. Hmm, that's a darn shame. A darn shame. Oh well, it's mid-turn. Time to take a drink. Ottomans are just being the Ottomans. They're waiting for us to pluck their cities right out from underneath their empire. Do 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 Sweden Savoy. Hopefully that just knocked off one of the guys that was uh looting our trade. I would like that very, very much. Because ideally, when we declare war on the Mughals again, I want to uh, kill, just completely end them off in like two or three rounds. That would be the ideal scenario for that. All right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They they're breaking stuff. I understand that. Barger infantry. Yeah, we have a lot of line infantry. I'm guessing these guys are mainly militia. Ooh. Yeah, this is one for the battle map. I was not expecting the 180 cavalry. Which I can neutralize that mainly with a few good diamond uh, formations, but they have infantry too, which is a smaller problem. <laughs> Admiral Nelson said duty. <laughs> oh, the, the, the immaturity of this. Okay. What do we got? Alright. Pretty much wide open. That's kind of what I'm shooting for here is a wide open area. Here we go. General's bodyguard. Yeah, that's about as good as we're gonna get. Come to me. Come to me. Send only your your cavalry first, please. Camels. Ooh, and they have a general in there too. Huh. What are, are they doing? Are they just dancing around the bush? Oh. What, what hell? Maybe we'll have to go up to them. Neither side has um, artillery, so it's all down to the to the individual soldier. Okay, the general get, gets to walk. Otherwise, he's gonna stamp stampede over all, over all, all of our men. And that would suck. That would really, really, really suck. Okay, what do we got here? Camel nomads, landless rabble, a general. Peasantry, camel nomads, camel nomads. 
A lot of nomads in these parts. A lot of nomads. All right, halt. Pre 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 prepare to fire. Oh, you're done, buddy. You're done. You're so done. Diamond formation. Lock it up, lock it up, lock it up. They didn't get to lock it up. Yep, there it is, though. There it goes. Yep, they successfully locked, locked up that diamond formation. Alright. Zoom line line formation again. Very nice. Very nice. Trade trade blows with you guys all damn day. That we can. Alright, slide those units forward a, a tad. I don't usually use this this uh, command, but forward march everybody they're gonna send another single unit of cavalry halt backspace bam let them have it blasted fire fire what are you doing what are you doing no yeah okay good <laughs> I'm like what are you doing what are you doing yep they're gonna bounce off huh <laughs> even the general gets a few few easy shots in I like it All right. Let's sprint these guys forward. All right. I'm gonna speed this up just just to give my troops a little bit of rest because these guys are winded. Yeah, they're still just gonna fire at them. Yeah, kick their ass. Kick their ass. Active, fresh, fresh all the way down. Alright. Fire, advance. Alright, the enemy's not doing anything. Let's advance again. Clean this this uh, line up here a little bit. Clean it up. I heard elephants moving, or elephants receiving orders, or or something similar. Hmm. Landless rabble. Landless rabble. Armed peasantry. Slightly bigger leap forward now. Trying to do this and take as few casualties as I possibly can. Fire. Impressive. Yeah, now it's just, uh... Are these guys melee units? Yeah, they are. <laughs> melee units, melee units, a general... And these guys actually have firearms, but it's not gonna matter. Why not? Run forward. I think the closer units are, the more accurate that they are, but I don't have any, you know, evidence that actually that can back that up. So it's it's just what I think as far as, you know, experience. Oh my god, a point point blank shot. There we go. Attacked in the rear. Lulls. Alright. Chase that. That enemy general. Chase that enemy general. Push through our own units. <laughs> They're stuck in our lines. That's so funny. Alright. Forget this. <laughs> We're not going to catch up to them now. Oh my gosh. That's funny. That... <laughs> 
That's, that's terribly funny. Alright, so we crushed... Well, we didn't crush the uh, Rebellion, but we made them rout pretty darn hard. Let's do it again. Yep, there we go. Trait gained? What trait? Uh, plus one morale, plus one when leading infantry units. Very nice, very nice. Okay. Let's repair this, repair that. Ooh, we have more spices. I like trading spices. Hmm. Rice patties. Let's make this one a cotton plantation. Just to have a nice balance when the when and if the 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 uh, game price decides to fluctuate. Um, tries to fluctuate us. Okay, Thurker's mansion. That's all fine and good. Let's get another Thurker's mansion. Okay, let's end another turn. It looks like we've done most of what we can do. Descent is subsiding. Towards the end of this video, we will probably take the rest of India. And once we do that, the Mughals are are out, and their fleets should, should for the most part, they should just, you know, disband. Okay, trade agreement with Prussia. Give them Hyderabad. They'll give me Wurttemberg. I'll give you a nice fuck off. We will not give you... I don't even understand that. Why would I give them part of, you know, India? And Hy Hyderabad is, like, right in the center of India. It's just a bad... It's a bad joke. It's just a bad joke, is, is, is all that that was. <laughs> yes, let me give you one of my most in influential cities. Like, I might give them, like, Gawa Gawa, but... I'm not gonna give them... Um, Hyderabad, because I think that one actually, uh... That one's actually making me, uh, um, like, either cotton or tea. So, it makes me a lot of money, and I don't want to trade that. Not, not for anything. Barbary States. Okay, small tea plan plantations finished. Excellent. Yeah, wow, we, we just made a crap load of money. Let's go down here, we'll build the Zomer's Corridor, however you want to say it. There's a there's already a sub Subadar's Palace. Let us build up the rest of these. You don't really need to upgrade all these military buildings here. Um let's get the Raja's observatory. Because the Thurker's mansions will provide repression, and that's kind of what we need. Let's build that. That'll repress them a significant amount. Need to fix that, baby. Fix that, baby, too. Your Majesty. So now they are happy enough to pay taxes without having an army garrison their city. That is very, very good. Awesome, this army is about ready to leave the eastern side of, of India and make its way to the western, western area to assist with, well, everything, to be honest. Diplomatic relations, Prussia, let's try and get a good trade. They're at war with... Jesus, they're at war with everybody. Britain, Poland, Lithuania... The Barbary States and Austria. I don't want to trade with them. It's going to cause like mega drama. Okay. Savoy. They're at war with the Barbary States. Let's do this. We will give you. We have no technology that they do not already have. Okay. We will offer you such and such as unacceptable to you. Alright, looks like we're going to gain two, two brand new uh, tech technologies next turn, so... Well, that's good. Alright, end. Oh, yon, 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 yon,
Mountain Dew time. Oh yeah. Sweet elixir of diabetes. <laughs> hmm. Trying to pay attention to what everyone over in Europe is doing, but it doesn't look like they're really doing much. One of the reasons why I think Prussia probably wanted to actually get, you know, a trade agreement with us is, um, their offers, they'll give us four yield crop rotation and empiricism. Hmm. I'm gonna go with no. Yeah, because basically that would give them their, their capital back, and I don't want to do that. I really don't want to do that. Okay. Raj's Observatory. Rebuild the college there. Yeah, and they're going to give me Kashmir, which is way up in, in the top there. Jeez, must think I'm stupid or something. Um, let's see here, what do we got? Can upgrade that. It's a prosperous town, so it's gonna be worth a little bit more. What are we researching now? Yeah, we're now we're researching uh, all the good stuff. Let's build up the drill school. Swan War Wada, what the frick is this? This thing looks amazing. This happiness, another recruitment thing. Nah. Like it's like it's good, but it's not great, if that makes sense. Let's build a great arsenal so we can research more th more things. More things. Alright. Great Char Charlo or Charbo or whatever. I think that's looking like an like an end turn to me. Let's repair the ordnance factory, repair the barracks so things stop smoking in the town. Yeah, that we can move our our troops out now. Fantastic. Alright, looks like the Moogles are just about taken care of, but uh, thanks for watching guys. This has been Timbo X Gaming, plays Empire Total War, the Maratha Confederacy Campaign.